Hey everyone, happy Friday. It is tea time with the diva. Grab your tea, grab your coffee, because we're going to get into it. This tea time is dedicated to Richard Williams, Serena Williams, and Venus Williams' dad. He's 82 years old, uh, has a younger wife. The wife is half his age. I think she's about 45. And at first, they was going back and forth in this tumultuous relationship. She filed for divorce. He filed for divorce. The home that he pretty much, um, for a good portion of their lives, raised Venus and Serena. And she tricked him somehow, took the home out of his name, put it in her name, took the equity out on the home. The home was about to go on foreclosure. They said the home is in, in, in disarray, so to speak, needs a lot of repairs. But all of a sudden, she's back in a relationship with Richard Williams. Somehow, she miraculously got all his money to pay off the debt, and now the home is not going to um, be sold. Um, it's interesting. Don't know where the money came from, but let's get into this story so we can hear more about it. Hold on one second. Let me share a screen. I, I wonder if secretly Serena and her sister saved the home. I don't know. Let's, but let's listen to part of the backstory. Child, Venus's you mean right now? Yeah. House that be worth a million dollars easy. It's a beautiful house, as far as I'm concerned. It, it, it's a, 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 a image. The image, ten acres of land. It's unbelievable image, huh? So I found out that um, the house had been signed over to Lakeisha, and then once I found this information out, I went to my dad and was like, "Dad, the house isn't in your name anymore. It's in Lakeisha's name." He told me that. <laughs> Lakeisha told him the house was in my name, not her name. <laughs> so I went to the courthouse in Palm Beach and I printed out the documentations. And I said, Dad, how can the house be in my name when it says Lakeisha Williams right here? And then we just uh, decided to start taking legal actions from there. Had you already filed for divorce at that point? Uh, the divorce filing was kind of awkward between Lakeisha and my dad. My dad filed for divorce, and I want to say Lakeisha filed for divorce at the same time. Right. I, I believe the divorce situations came out actually a bit after um, the situations with the house. Well, my dad realized he needed to divorce from Lakeisha he was with me for a while, and then we took our time to just really go through all the paperwork, bank statements, everything else, and that took some time. Uh, so, and then at the same time, my dad's health had to be uh, handled. I, I myself have not really had any real conversations with Lakeisha, nor do I feel like I need to have any conversation with Lakeisha, but Lakeisha has like yelled and she had a whole bunch of stuff my way when she would see me. But I, I just, like I said, at the end of the day, my main goal is to make sure my dad's okay, period. So I, I could care less how she or anybody else feel. And there's been in the court documents, it's been back and forth, back and forth, that he's going to lose the house, um, you know, their childhood home, that that could go. Where are we at now with that? The house right now, they've been saying for over a year or so now. Uh, it's, it's public knowledge that Keisha's only made about, I think, two payments, three payments. Mm. Well, now, though, even though she um, wasn't making payments miraculously, step in. Bon appetit. Into Wix Studio, the web platform for agencies and enterprises. I'll just mute it since it won't pause. So change of heart, King Richard's son breaks silence on dad's reunion with a strange wife after the divorce dismissed and home saved from auction. Um, she was fortunate to um, find this money. I don't know how she did it. So King Richard's, um, King Richard Williams' son has spoken of dad's surprise romantic reunion with his estranged wife who saved their marital home from auction to pay off colossal debts. Serena Williams' stepmom, Lakeisha, 
admitted in court documents to forging her husband's signature to transfer the house into her name. So that's King Richard. That's his son from his first marriage, um, the marriage before he got in, um, married to um, Serena and Venus' mom. So that's King Richard in the is first estranged wife, but now she's the wife again, okay? So Lakeisha claims she did so to feed their son, Dylan, after Richard left her with no way to put food on the table. His counsel denied the claim at the time, and Richard went through years of battling through courts to try to, to try and divorce his third wife and make claims she also stolen his social security checks and vehicles. Richard's 82 filed back in 2017 in Florida, seven years after tying the knot with Lakeisha, 45. Back in September 22, his son posted on Instagram, it's shameful what is um, what he is going through caused by Lakeisha. Hopefully she will get what is due to her. Prison time for elderly abuse and forgery. But unfortunately, um, she never served any of that. It's interesting. I don't, I don't know, like the way these things work are so weird, but also, I think the person that it is done against, they have to cooperate in some way too. And it seems like now King Richard decided to reconcile with his wife. He also told the U.S. son he wanted his dad to get a divorce as quickly as possible as she was taking advantage of him. But after Richard had the divorce suddenly dismissed early this year, the family has welcomed her back into the fold. Um, his son previously said his dad only called it off because of health problems, but it has since emerged he is back in a romantic and sexual relationship with his estranged wife, according to her lawyer, which uh, I, I don't know how true that is. I mean, she took advantage of him once. She's probably still taking advantage of him and probably saying that they're back in a relationship so that she doesn't do any jail time and she doesn't um, you know, pay the price for trying to steal his home and whatever else she was trying to do. Um, she was set to lose their former marital home in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, this week after she failed to pay off a loan and found herself owing more than $436,000. But the auction was canceled at the last minute after she mysteriously managed to pay off the huge sum. That is interesting. Speaking exclusively to the U.S. son, um, King Richard's son said, the house is safe and sound. Keisha worked a miracle. She satisfied the debt, whatever um, whatever it was that was reported. I have no clue how. I'm told it wasn't from my dad. He wanted to keep it in the family, so he's happy regardless, his son went on. I'm not sure what's going on with those two. My dad's like the win at some times. I've been buried in my own world, but everybody was pretty happy. So that's just how I see it right now. It's not the same energy when you um, when he spoke to you, not at all. If he changes his mind and does want a divorce, he can just call me and tell me the lawyer's on standby. So you know what I do like about his son? His son is like, listen, it's my dad. Whatever he wants to do, he's going to do. It's his life. But if he's ready and he changes his mind and he wants to divorce her, I'm here and I'm going to help him. I don't know if this is in is if this is the ending or the beginning for those two. But my dad is happy, and that's all. And that's all that matters. A source claimed the funds did not come from Serena. Lakeisha previously alleged in court documents that the retired tennis champ threatened to change the locks if she did not vacate the home. At the time, Serena's rep declined to comment on the claim. Ironically, her elderly father and Lakeisha, a former stripper, are now living in a home just menaced from their old living in a new home, just menaced from their old crumbling property, which is in Serena's name. So it's funny. How did how did she even try to take it if the home is in Serena's name? It's it's just very confusing to me. Um, but it's an interesting story. Richard's um Richard Williams has been um keen to finalize his divorce from Lakeisha Graham for years, but their case um has dragged out amid a fight among their marital home. The couple married in 2010 when Lakeisha was 32 and Richards was 69. Williams is a hands-on father to their young son, Dylan, known as Junior, and has tried to maintain a good relationship with his ex despite the court case. May 2017, Richard filed from the, for divorce from Lakeisha after seven years of marriage. He claimed in his initial petition that she had forged his name on a deed to transfer um, on a deed transfer for their home and stole his social security checks. 
March 2020, court documents revealed excerpts from Lakeisha's testimony in which she admits to forging her exit, um, her exit signature and also selling his 1999 Bluebird Wonder Lodge motor coach worth 45,000. But she claims she did she did so as he had left her and their son to starve, which his legal team denied. February 2022, Lakeisha told a judge that her stepdaughter, Serena, wanted to lock her out of the family home. She claimed a letter from the tennis star's lawyers threatened to change the locks if she did not vacate the property. Her legal team at the time did not respond to requests for comment. June 2022, Richard filed a $1 million lawsuit against Lakeisha despite her claiming in court documents they had reconciled and had been sleeping together, which he later denied. July 2022, their home was valued at $1.45 million and was due to be auctioned off, but Lakeisha filed for Chapter 13 bankruptcy and stalled the sale. The bankruptcy case was dismissed on July 5th, but she filed to, um, have, to have it reinstated, claiming she had found money for a repayment plan. She was in hundreds of thousands of dollars of debt after taking out a huge loan from a hard lender and not paying it back. January 2023, the U.S. son sat down with Richard for a world-exclusive interview in which he accused extra for Lakeisha of taking everything and blowing his cash, asking how he feels about the split. He said, I just want a divorce. It's been six years, man. Just a bunch of junk, junk, junk. I'm so tired of that junk now. But he didn't seem to be getting any closer to finalizing it, and his lawsuit was tossed out by a judge. August 2023, it was stated that Lakeisha was struggling to keep up with her repayment plan as she battled to keep the house, where she um, was said to be living despite it needing extensive repair work. April 2024, Richard missed the court date and deposition as he suffers from speech problems due to strokes and didn't want to um, be misunderstood. As a result, he had the case dismissed but planned to refile. Lakeisha tried for months to starve off the house being sold at auction by filing for Chapter 13 bankruptcy three times, but each attempt failed. July 2024, Richard's son confirms he is no longer pursuing a divorce and the pair are happy after reconciling. It comes days after she managed to somehow settle her $436,000 debt to save their former marital home from auction. The U.S. son has reached out to Lakeisha's bankruptcy lawyer, Ellis, um, for comment and on how she settled um, the debt, but did not hear back. The debt at one stage was over $600,000 after she failed to stick to a repayment plan. She had repeatedly attempted to file for bankruptcy to try and save the house, but her efforts failed before she managed to stump up um, the cash. The property um, means a, a lot to the family, as it were Serena and Venus were, were trained on a tennis course by their father before becoming sporting superstars. Divorce attorney Sarah Lawrence previously slammed um, King Richard's son and said that he is not a blood relative and has been interfering in Richard's and, Ke and Lakeisha's lives. Um, the son declined to comment on how he is related to Serena and Venus' father, but has always been by his side. While Richard himself previously told the U.S. son he was um, desperate for a divorce. Well, now they, are they saying this is not his real son? This is crazy. He accused Lakeisha of taking everything, adding, I just want a divorce. It's been six years, man. Just a bunch of junk, junk, junk. But now it seems he has a change of heart. Lauren said in a statement after it was dismissed, Richard Dove Williams and his wife, Lakeisha Williams, have a son and are raising him together. They are a family. Lakeisha works and Richard often takes care of their son. Lakeisha and Richard Williams have a romantic and sexual relationship. With their son, they are family. They live together. They go on family trips to Disney together. You know, they need to stop. They need to stop. Um, whew, this Lakeisha. Do I think perhaps allegedly there's some elder abuse about involved in this situation? I do. Do I think um she's really living with this man as husband and wife? I don't. Um, but is am I curious to know where she came up with almost a million dollars from to save this um home, the marital home? I am curious. I mean, it's really, really interesting. But anyway, guys. 
Chat with me in the comments. And when I get an opportunity, I will chat back. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. If you are a subscriber, welcome back, everybody. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, hit the like button. Let me know your thoughts on this story. And, you know, what do you think about Lakeisha? What do you think about this dad getting back with her? Listen, at the end of the day, if you have a man and you have a, a lady involved and that lady happens to be the wife or the strange wife, um, the wife knows what she can do to get him back in her good graces. And especially because it seems like he is not, uh, like he's struggling with some health issues. So who knows what she did to smooth her way back in. But anyway, guys, let me know your thoughts on this story. Chat with me and I will chat back. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. If you are a subscriber, welcome back. Everybody, thanks for watching. Let me know your thoughts and I'll see you in the next video.